is after two days. We've already had a few issues. This big old chunk is missing already. And there's a piece right there waiting to fall off. As you can see, they didn't pack it well, so there's literal pieces that I could fit my whole finger in. I don't like this kind of work. So we're trying to see if they could come and fix it, if they can. If not, then I'm gonna be very angry. They took the wood off really early. I think maybe two hours after they poured the cement. And now we have cracks on the big slab. So let's hope that they fix this because if not, I could be crazy. But besides that, it's time to take all my medicine or my vitamins. So, oh my god, my water is still in. Let's take some vitamins together. Let's calm down a bit because that got me really heated really, really bad. Got all my vitamins. I started taking Inisitol because I noticed that Ovisitol doesn't really do much for me. So I wanted to try this one. Granted, I've only been this taking this for, I'm on my third day, but I've already seen a little bit of a difference. I'm, my stomach doesn't hurt as often anymore and I'm starting to feel happier in a way, like I'm more content rather than pouting and being upset all the time. So praying that this helps me get my period back. Let's take our vitamins. Ugh. Mm. That was a big one. Thank you very much. Let's get on with the motherfucking day. Hi guys, we just got home from Marshall's. So first thing we got, we've been obsessed over diffusers lately. Shh. Shh. Careful, don't knock it over. We're gone. Can you clean my floor? I just mopped. <gasps> you got two. That's an awesome boy. Is you are. Didn't tinkle. He's growing up. Damn, motherfucker! Just take the whole cup, would you? Almost took my damn pointer finger. Wanted ah. you guys to have a little doggo content. I love my baby, so we stopped by Dutch Bros because when we get Dutch Bros, our baby gets Dutch Bros. And he it's literally one of his favorite things. He, he knows it. He does. As soon as he we get into the lines, he'll start whining because he wants it so bad. And he doesn't bark at the people who come up to the window anymore. He just cries. Yeah, he's like, beep, 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 beep. The only time that he does though is when they start trying to pet him. He don't like to be pet by strangers. We taught him stranger danger. What's going on over there, babe? I'm this one Oh. I really wanted this one because it looked like a lamp. Ooh! Oh, that's so pretty. Okay, so it looks like this. It looks like a lamp. It's got a little little thingy in that. We're gonna put this one here in the living room because this is specifically for larger rooms. Yeah. And we need a larger room because the, of course, we're in the living room. And I just thought this would be so cute because it's more of a decorative piece rather than the one that we got. So we're just gonna put that one that we have here in the living room into our room. Sure. It's going to yeah. look way better here in the living room because of, did you make the smell? Because of how pretty and then, I don't know if you guys can see, but there is like a little wave texture to it. I really like that too. This was $20. What is this, $20? Uh-huh, $19.99. Oh, 
There was another one that we were going to get for the room specifically that was that was ten dollars and it also came with essential oils but it just looks so tiny and I feel like our, our room is more so of a medium room so I would just tell Sal like let's just move the one that's here already to our room our room so that way we didn't have to spend extra money on top of because this would have been thirty dollars alone for just this one and the other one I feel like I talk better when I'm rushing to get the words out because if I take too long to talk I'm like um, um. <laughs> okay so the next thing that we grabbed was this little shower caddy um, it's a three tier I don't know if you guys can see it is silver we didn't I don't really care for the color there they did have a black one that matches our decor pieces inside the shower um, but that was $20 and this one's 17 so I want to save those extra three bucks. Cray is inspecting the stuff that we have. The next few things that we grabbed are decor pieces. I'm going to be fixing up the bathroom. Technically, Sal's going to be fixing it up because let's be honest, I can't make anything straight for the life of me. Even with... I literally even with the um, what's it called measure and the little leveler it still comes out crooked like this TV the reason why it's crooked is because of me because I told Sal and my cousin that it was straight and then when they finally settled it in it was like leaning to the left <laughs> we don't talk about that I blame it on them all the time it's also our nephew's birthday this weekend and we grabbed some stuff for his gift we have some wrapping paper this not even wrapping paper this is wrapping tissue and these were $2.99 for 24 sheets we have a card that's $2.99 it's just a happy birthday card and then a cute little happy birthday. I really wish that it followed the themes of the balloons and the color. But these, this was literally the nicest one that I found that would fit his gift. And so this was $2.99. Yes, I could have gone to Dollar Tree or Dollar Twenty Five Tree, but we were. It's that's what it's called now. But we wanted to do a one done shop. And then last but not least, the reason why this kid keeps smelling everything because he knows that I spoil him, so he knows that whenever we go out, he gets something, but we got him a little elephant. Do you see his tail? It's wagging because he knows it's for him. But we got this one for him, mm. and how much was this, babe? Uh, a few bucks. $5.99. He's so... I bought him another... While I talk, let me cut this. But I bought him another one. It was another elephant. And he ruined that in like five seconds. And that was $10. But this one's $5.99. And I don't really care if he ruins it. It doesn't have a squeaker. That's the only downside. But he usually got, just uh, likes to... It's got rope inside. That's what he's on. Ah. We have the two decorative oh, I fake see plants. Right here, baby. Hmm? Right here. That's the only flaw with that, huh? Oh, it lights up. That's cute. Yeah. So we got decorative plants again. This one is a smaller one. It's $15. And this one is going to go into the bathroom above the toilet because we bought some stuff to hook onto it. Then we have a second planter with the same color pot. And this one was $9.99. We're not sure why the bigger one is cheaper than the smaller one, but we didn't complain because now we have two of them and I just feel like they're gonna be so cute. We're gonna add the bigger one onto the wall on the other side just to fill in the spaces that we didn't have decor pieces for. Now the next two things, I'm not gonna pull out the other one, but this was on sale for $18. This is a rattan shelf. We're gonna put this above the toilet. I think it's just gonna look really cute. Just imagine this, like this, above the toilet. Isn't that cute or no? Cute or no? I think so. 
<laughs> what, like a candle or something? Ew, he's smacking your mouth for. Because it's good. I can't believe the big one is cheaper. cheaper than the small one. That makes no sense. But I'll take it. We also got some blemish tools. I have very pigmented skin, and so uh, I like to poke at it. And so I just grabbed this. It's four ninety nine. Can't go wrong. It even comes with a little cover, which is why I like it. Get out of here, please. Get over here, Craig. Next, Sal grabbed these Nike slides for $12.99. They always look so big, but then whenever it's on his feet, they fit perfectly, so I don't even question it anymore. We grabbed two of these umbrellas for $6.99 each. Uh, the reason why we grabbed this was because when we went out for Valentine's Day, it was so random, it just started to rain and we needed an umbrella that day and we did not have one, so we're just gonna keep one in the car and then one here in the house. We also got a steamer. I kind of forgot we got this. This is $14.99. We got it for the curtains because when we washed the bottom of it, it got really wrinkly and so we got it. Oh, also we have satin bed sheets and it always comes out super wrinkly and we never want to do the iron with it because it burns the satin. Got the steamer for that as well, just so that way it looks cleaner. Check this. And battery's dying again. <laughs> you need to charge it, homie. I don't know. I just got off a very long, a very, very long meeting and an Amazon package came. I believe that this is my nephew's um, gift, birthday gift. So just wanted to show you guys what we got him. It's a lot smaller than I expected, but he really wanted this Lego set um, ramen house. It's a Japanese street mini edition. And that's what it looks like. And you can have like a little matcha bakery or matcha place. And you can have a flower one, a flower business. The one that we got him was the ramen one because he really wanted the ramen one. And I'm not too sure what this one is. But I asked my cousin what he wanted and this was the only thing off his wish list that they sent us so that's exactly what we got him it's a little small but if he's happy about it then that's all that that makes me happy I also got a few things from work because I need a new keyboard and a new docking station so let's open that up together it's so tiny isn't it yeah <laughs> beautiful beautiful oh this one's different Right? Or is this the same? So I have a new docking station. And then, lastly, I got a Logitech keyboard and mouse um, duo. Very pretty. Let's see. Look how humongo this is. This is the size of my head. I like that it has like a little cushion right here. It's not the best cushion on it, but it's definitely something else. It's humongous though, look at it. And then you have to have your hand here. And I like that it has like the little curvatures on the keyboard to allow your hands to rest better. That's really cool. You have like a little zoom option, media center, you could screenshot everything. You have a calculator button. You could turn on your PC through this keyboard. Then lastly, you get a mouse with it. This is the reason why I was complaining because it's just a simple mouse, which I have a ton of. So don't know why they got me the kit, but I do like how it has little grips on the side. And it's really nice, I think. But this one is my ergonomics one that I just love even more. 
ever since I switched to this one right here, I haven't had any carpal tunnel issues, especially with my right hand. Very excited, okay? I'm very excited for my new mouse and keyboard. I will try out this new mouse and see if I like the feeling of this one. I just got in an Ulta package. We get a face wash from, oh my god, my hair, I didn't even notice how crazy I looked. But, aw, this one came all crazy. I usually get these face wash from Ulta. It's the First Aid Beauty. This is the one with red clay in it. Sal and I absolutely love this face wash. We go through it like crazy because we're both using it every single day. I will say that when starting this, I didn't really have a ton of acne, but I did get a ton of whiteheads and blackheads around this part of my face, which is like my nose and my T-zone area. But ever since I switched to this one, and because I'm way more oily in the sections, the lady at Ulta told us about this one because of the red clay. We actually use this while we're in the shower, so that way we can like really solidify it into our skin while we're doing the rest of our body care routine in the shower. We also do it at night before we go to bed, so highly recommend this guy right here. Also got retinol from The Ordinary brand. The reason why that I like using The Ordinary stuff is because my skin is very sensitive, so it helps when I have single ingredient things and I can figure out what exactly is hurting my skin. So like I've been saying, we've been using this for about maybe half a year already. I've noticed a completely different thing when I use it and so has Sal. Like his face got so much better after using this. But as I was saying about the retinol, I like using the Ordinary brand because they're single ingredients and I'm very sensitive when it comes to new products so I can eliminate it if this is the reason why I'm breaking out again. Next thing I grabbed is this ordinary <laughs> is this ordinary moisturizer. The reason why I grabbed this, we already use it all the time, um, especially since here in Arizona, the water is super, super rough. And ever since I started using this, my skin on my face started to feel way more moisturized so whenever I do my makeup and I wear foundation or concealer and I don't put on this my face looks like a reptile like you can see the dry skins the dry patches and it's just not cute so I think this is really nice to have at least I wanted to try this it's not your mother's all eyes on me 10 in 1 hair protect hair perfecter so I believe that this is just like to detangle. Oh here, 10 instant benefits. It adds body, detangles, adds shine, protects, moisturizes, controls frizz, repairs damaged hair, heat protection, mends split ends, and creates silkness. I want to try this now. It smells really good. So my hair is on day two hair, and as you can see, it's super clunky at the bottom because of how dead my hair is. So I'm just gonna add this into my hair. Oh, it actually kind of smells like a sneeze with perfume in it. Is that weird to say? I feel like that's really weird to say. But it smells like a sneeze. Yeah, it smells like a sneeze with perfume. Um, I'm not convinced that I like this scent all that much, but I mean, if it makes my hair super shiny or adds the volume and does whatever the crap these 10 things say, then I guess I'll stick out with it, but I definitely need more more recommendations for heat protectors because that was the main reason I got this. There was just so many things to choose from, but I mean... Do I care that it smells like a sneeze? 
You know what kind of smells like? The Mario Badesio face sprays. Like those kind of smell like a like a floral sneeze to me. I don't know if that makes any sense, but it makes sense to me. Good morning. It is now the next day. It is Tuesday, February 28th. I just got an Amazon package. This is gonna be a small one because the rest of the stuff either comes tomorrow or the next day. This came overnight and it got here at like five in the morning, which is pretty freaking cool. I bought a five pack of memory cards. They're each 32 gigs. That's the same as the one that I have now. These were 32 bucks for five. And I know it seems kind of expensive because it honestly is, but I run out of storage so much. So this will come in handy. We have a big trip coming up. I want to make sure that I have enough storage for everything. So this is one of the things that I got. I will be getting the rest of the stuff soon, just not today. Alrighty guys, I got a really cool package in today. I grabbed these battery sets. Um, it comes with a dual charging pack with two batteries and an actual plug for them. These battery packs are called Beston. Compatible with a Canon EOS Rebel T6i. And I'm going to charge them in and make sure that they all charge properly and they fit the camera. So I'm gonna see, I'm gonna test it out and I'll let you guys know if it actually works and if it retains the battery life when I'm using it. So I am testing out the new battery today. Remember it's this one right here. As you can see, I stole the first one. And this is the actual Canon one, so I have to charge this one on a separate battery holder, which is fine because then I don't want to ruin the integrity of the battery itself, especially since it's the one that came with it. Salva and I went to Costco, Best Buy, and Target. We didn't get anything from Target, and we got one thing from Best Buy that I'm sure you guys aren't really interested about, but we did buy a few things from Costco, so let me show you guys. We got these Cheetos, Hot Flaming Tangy Chili Fusion. We've never seen this before, but we've seen it at Costco, so we grabbed them. We also got two packs of water. We grabbed these two bath mats, and then we're also washing and drying. Hello. We're also washing and drying two more, so I'll show you guys that in the next vlog. But I will be ending the vlog here. I know that this vlog was more so different types of hauls. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. If you are new here, my name is Dawn Annika. I make lifestyle content, vlogs, shop with me's, clean with me's, hauls, and all of the above. If you like those kind of videos, then be sure to hit the subscribe button down below. And as always, comment, like, share. I don't care as long as you're loving the journey just as much as we are. Bye.